that honestly, I mean, looking at it on a day now, no wonder it's customer top rated because you're going to put this on and people are going to ask you if this has been passed down. Hey, is this a vintage piece? Exactly. Is it an air family heirloom? Absolutely. Well, the origin of this particular necklace, and this was a necklace that you added additional charms to, and we have some of the additional charms as well, but this was a, a piece that Joan's husband bought her in Paris from the Fabergé dealer Wartsky in Paris, mm -hmm. and it was made for Marie of Romania, who at, in her day was known as the most fashionable woman in the she world. She was a hip lady. She was major hip, and she was the queen of Romania. And Joan wore this occasionally, and then finally the insurance company said, put it back in the vault and really don't. It's really museum quality. I did bring a picture of Joan wearing the original and you'll see that she it's so just great. remarkable in that it's... I mean, she looks uh, like the queen of New York City. She looks exactly. But you see the original necklace had, you know, it went around her neck three or four times, had over 120 egg charms and different charms that Maria of Romania had collected on it. And then we started reproducing all of the eggs from the necklace itself. And it to me is a work of art. I love that you have all made this top rated. I'll walk you through each one of the charms if you'd like, if I'd we have time. I'd love to. Um, generous Easy Pay today, $26.25 with our Easy Pay every day. But remember, if you've got a Q card, it comes home for six Easy Payments. The length of the chain, 21 and a half inches. Yep. It comes boxed with a gorgeous pouch and, of course, the cards. And it's from the private collection, so you'll get actually a little purple velvet pouch and a little... I love a little, that. Me too. You guys um, only... Did I count it right? Eight charms? It's nine charms. Nine charms. And okay. then a little hang tang on the back. But keep in mind, each one of these little segments of chain is removable. So what you're going to do is open up the little so spring ring pretty. and add maybe a charm of your own to make it customized. Oh, what a great but we idea. start with the lock and key, which is right off of the original. Uh, we go to this was a, an egg that Fabergé made in steel. He loved platinum, wow. he loved gold, and he also worked in black and steel. So it's a little fluted egg. This is an actual <gasps> piece of goldstone which again is right from the Fabergé egg, oh and Goldstone just has such life inside of it. Really, really beautiful. That is spectacular. Isn't that amazing? Now, Joan's original here in the green would have been jade set with diamonds, but it's a faithful reproduction, and it looks to me just like jadeite. I mean, it that really does so look amazing. Awesome. Um, I happen to love the one that sits at the base of the neck, and that's that beautiful Art Nouveau. Mm -hmm. It's a lily of the valley with what would be probably a little sapphire or a little... Um, uh, probably a little, um, maybe a sapphire yeah. and a little pink diamond and yeah, some pearls. Sure. Um, and I'm going to try I love how it. unusual and Every single one is. Each yeah. one of them is. I mean, how about a little rose gold wrapped egg in a basket? Again, oh, based on Joan's so original. Now, this at particular, the, the ladybug charm, this was actually added by Joan. This was the very first piece of Fabergé Joan ever bought. It was the only thing they could probably afford when they first got married. And this was... Uh, the one that's on the necklace now was actually added by Joan. Wow. So we're recreating what it's we call like Melissa's ladybug. Um, this guy was a piece of frosted rock crystal set with turquoise. These are all coming on the necklace and they're all removable. You could wear them all individually if you choose. Wow. And then I love the little egg that's on its side with what's called a girdle wrapping it mm -hmm. in that beautiful guilloche enamel. And then in the back, That'll be where you open it up to put it over your head, and that's just a little jump ring with a little Joan Rivers tag on it as well. And so it's just beautiful piece, exquisite work of art. And I mean, I, mean, I would honestly, say, I am somebody that when it came to the Fabergé egg collection that Joan would do with the ornaments, oh, I was all so like, beautiful. I would look in our company directory and be like, when is there, it coming they come, out? Here they come. <laughs> when is the order placed? That's and so awesome. I would say if that's something that you fancy, definitely consider giving this as a gift for the holidays. Oh my. I mean, you'll have that January 31st Wouldn't that be an amazing return gift? Uh, gift, but you look at it on a day and it's like fully home run. The customer top rated reviews on the bottom, I mean, take a look at it. I this mean, is a beauty. It's just the right size. The eggs are not oversized. And they all Wait for other eggs to come they, out. They, uh, we add additional eggs, and you can remove and rearrange these in the order you like. Maybe you want to wear a single egg on your own chain. This is the exact color of a sweater we have coming up in the show, that turtleneck. Oh, that's so, so if you're thinking how, that how you wear this for so holiday. That to me looks so Tiffany's, that little fabric oh, right there. That. If I you wore it. it on a single and, chain. Oh, absolutely. But then the Art Nouveau Lily of the Valley, which is a faithful reproduction of Jones. The Jade. I mean, each one is a little work of art on its own. And I think, 
you know, like, wow, you could actually take and put some of your favorite mm -hmm. charms, maybe charms from a charm bracelet that you love to wear. Oh, but sure. But really kind of make it your own and then add more chain and add more charms as you My continue favorite. to collect. But it is part of our private collection, and that is the Taking Jones actual jewelry. Yes. I didn't know it was in the show today, or I would have had Melissa send it to me from California from the vault. <laughs> I would have shown you the original. But again, the insurance doesn't really like us even taking it out of the vault anymore. It will go to a museum one day. It'll probably go back to the Metropolitan in New York, where Joan exhibited this in the Fabergé sure, show. Sure. I have a feeling it's going to end up living there, where well, it should. You know. Absolutely. And I mean, what a working wa a walk of art that you get to add to any Quite outfit. Beautiful. And with all of those great colors, you never have to question oh, is this the day that I wear my Fabergé necklace? <laughs> the answer will always be Answer's yes. yes. <laughs> it's J353040. I have a favor, and it's a pretty big tell ask me, tell of me. you. So you know, obviously, Joan loved bees, and you guys oh. have some amazing brooches and it's pendants. Our, it's our signature. It's our. It's the if iconic guys, symbol. If you guys ever make handbags, will you do the <gasps> Put a you bee? know what? Yeah. Oh, like would right that be amazing? Where the like lock a is, like a large one. Oh, that would one. be so pretty. What a great idea. You know, I'm gonna start working on some handbags. That's a really fun. Well, you, you know, know where we, I got that from. Tell me, tell me. Who? <laughs> I'm not who's who. Who? <laughs> well, you know, no. What's funny is we've been making bees forever, and all of a sudden Gucci is putting bees over everything. It's I'm on the loafers. You. It's on the belt buckle. It's on the I wouldn't everything. Hate it. I wouldn't I, hate it. I'm, I'm right there with you, baby. Right. <laughs> so funny. Okay, so get excited oh, because we're top. gonna give you a little sneak peek of the animal print pants that are coming up later on in the show with Ooh. this next top that we are presenting. Okay, so how great are those python pants? Thank you. Thank I you. I mean, just a just a casual.